Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm out here on my poor man's construction site today. The bowl, or what used to be the bowl, it's flattening out nicely. We have the 48 Ford 8 in. I have a little bit of a backblading project to do, so I put the King Cutter backblade on there. It's a six foot wide one, and honestly, for the power and weight of this tractor, I wouldn't want anything bigger. Um, it's pretty well matched to it as it is. But, we got some weather moving in. I apologize if we have some uh, wind interference with the camera here. Kind of out in the open, I don't have much of a refuge from it, but you can see the ridge is basically gone. Bowl is pretty much flat. I've got a little bit to pull from down here yet, and then do some drainage work up in there. But, and I got the D2 and the Farm All H and the Tumble Bug, which has proved quite popular lately. But I've got some work to do up in here on my little access road. So we'll just walk up and take a look. The old H boy, I've put some miles on her the last few days on the tumble bug as well. Nice and shiny down there, just the way I like it. Anyway, as I was scraping some of the uh, remnants of the topsoil from that ridge over there, I kind of had some sand mixed in it, a few rocks. I didn't have any real good place to put it, but I just kept hauling it and depositing it up in here. And I'm going to use a back blade on that 8 end to try and get this leveled out. Now, I'm not counting on this being a road surface because there's not a lot in it for binder. But what this is meant to do is just level all this through here and take out all of the humps and holes and dips and hopefully turn it into something that will hold some gravel. And we're going to go all the way up to the field edge up there. So that is the plan. You can see I picked up some rocks. So there's some rocks to dig out of it. We'll take the 8 in and the back blade and just have a little bit of fun today to maybe get something accomplished too. I think I did improve the road quite a bit. The little eight in with the six foot back blade did the trick. And like I said, this is by no means a permanent road, but at least 
it is flat enough and smooth enough, I could take a passenger car through here now. Don't have to worry about bottoming out, scraping, or losing any fillings. So, pretty happy with all that's taken shape. And, like I said, we had some fun today. Drove the tractor around a little bit, moved a little bit of dirt. You know, actually accomplished something in the process. So, that's like a win-win-win in my book. Anyway, guys, the bowl is starting to take shape. It's looking like less of a bowl all the time. We're still a little bit low in the middle here. I left it a touch high on that edge up there on purpose because I have some more stuff from up ahead of the tractors up there to bring down this way. So I didn't want to chew that down too far when I might actually just build it up here and get it pretty well even with that. And what I'd like to do is actually have it a gentle slope off that way to improve drainage as well. But on behalf of the Ford 8N, the Farmall H, the Tumblebug Scraper, and the Iron Mistress just peeking out from across, or from beyond the tree over there. Thanks for watching, guys. See you back again.